All right, guys, how's it going? My name is Mr. Boss for the win. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get the tow truck in Grand Theft Auto Online. Now, typically, I'm against videos like this that really exploit and cheat the game. But in this case, I'm in a lobby all by myself, and I really just want to obtain the tow truck and see how it functions. So I approve of this if you're doing it for fun, but I do not approve of this method if you're going to grieve other people or tow their cars. I just don't think that's right. But anyways, let's get started. So what you need to do is have someone on your friends list or have someone that you know that already owns a tow truck. And then you're going to want to proceed to do uh, one of the missions. We had a lot of success with the uh, the Martin missions or Martin, uh, Martin Madrazo. So we had success with his missions. Any of them will work out of court settlement uh, mixed up with coke. Uh, either of these work. So what you're going to want to do is you get in the tow truck that your buddy has called for you. He can either dial his mechanic and bring it to you and then you want to hop in his car. Now, what you want to do next is drive this vehicle towards Los Santos Customs. Don't drive inside and don't get out of the vehicle, but just keep driving around, especially for a mission with mixed up with Coke. There's going to be guys that are coming after you, but as long as you're just doing kind of like a circle or a square, in this case around Los Santos Customs, they're not going to be able to catch you. So just do this and wait it out till your friend completes the mission because that's what you have to do first. You have to wait till the mission is complete and stay in the car. Once the mission is complete, you're going to spawn inside of the duplicated tow truck and it's no longer going to have your friend's personal tags, tracker, and insurance on it. Meaning it's going to be like you just found it on the street. This is where you can drive it up to the Los Santos Customs and this time the door will actually open and you'll be able to drive the tow truck inside. Now once you're there you can fit it with a tracker and in your case insurance as well so that you can keep the vehicle in case it gets blown up and then it will become your personal vehicle. So this is really cool. From there you can add a whole bunch of different things on it. You can you know, color it, you can add rims, you can put a different engine, you can put turbo in it like this one. This one's pretty souped up right here. And it's a lot of fun. The tow truck is one of my favorite vehicles of all time just because of it, its functionality is actually very lifelike. You can tow cars in the game. This is just a random NPC car. I'm not towing anyone's vehicle in here. I'm in a private session with one other person. So I, like I said, I approve of this method if you really want to just have some fun. But don't be that guy who goes around towing people's personal vehicles. I don't think that's fun. No one enjoys that, but this is how you get the tow truck. Fairly easy. Like I said, all you have to do is know someone who has the tow truck and is willing to help you do this. It takes about five minutes. Complete the mission. Stay in the car. Go to Los Santos Customs. Get it fit with a tracker and insurance, and a tow truck will be yours. So it's fairly straightforward, and it was really easy for me. Anyways, guys, if you did enjoy this video or found the information on the video helpful, I would encourage you guys to leave a like on the video and push that thumbs up button. And if you are new, I would encourage you guys to subscribe as well for more awesome Grand Theft Auto 5 content. Anyways, guys, take care. Thanks for watching the video, and I'll see you guys in the next video.